Hello guys, welcome back to Ventilate, and here we go. What do you guys reckon? You reckon there's gonna be another wheel, or there won't be a wheel? All right, let's see how it goes. Wish me all the luck I can get, because I am so sick of getting wheeled, mate. I've been wheeled the last three tournaments, uh, second, second, and third. So please, please, please. Oh, 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 that's, that's, that's what I like to talk about, guys. Woo! Let's not get wailed. Let's be the whale. Let's go. All right, I think I'm pretty much set here. Well, unless someone else is joining us around this time, then I am pretty much screwed. But fingers crossed, guys. I hope I do not get screwed in this one. Um, I'm, I'm quite ahead in the game. So this is looking pretty good. I'm so sorry, Mr. Americans, Jason and Moon Club. You are getting wailed. Just like Donald Trump and Kamala Harris debate, Donald Trump absolutely smashed it, right? Kamala just reading off the paper just like these guys living off nothing. That's what I'm talking about, guys. Absolutely amazing. So guys, I am going to try my best to keep this streak alive. Let me get that whale number one. All right, all right, all right. Okay, first things first, guys. I save this up. Let's get this going. Bang. Quick one. Quick one. Boom. Level it up. Everything is up. Nope. Still haven't discovered the last two. Can't even increase that just yet. So that's fine. It is what it is. Um, I, guys, I'm going to be honest with you. I do spend a bit on Titan Souls. Uh, I just feel like it is absolutely stunning, guys. Like It just does so much more and they have made a few changes guys i don't know if you have seen so today they came out with this new version of b12 uh glorious mac legendary uh equipment set automated magnum optus activation plus critical hits global raid so this is huge guys when it comes to the global raid we do now uh, have the ability to keep going from one world to the next world to the next world to the next world without actually stopping or waiting back in the days you kind of have to wait a little bit before you can get there so i think that is absolutely amazing and i like it and they have increased a few things for example aerial assault is up to 40 ambush 40 and j lake backstab chesterson increase um, so they're basically looking at like maxing things out and getting things a little bit further up in the ladder so that you don't just get uh, stuck at that point where you can actually get that a lot higher and a few buck fixes But the biggest thing for now is these ones jumping to 40. That's absolutely going to change the game How is it going to change? We're not really sure uh, Compedium is going to be a whole new different thing increase solo rate world on world completion So you move from the next solo rate world when completing a previous world So this has been absolutely stunning guys uh, just as myself. I've moved up one world and I'm up to this next world uh, Where am I? I am at 55 floor 55 and I am continuing to keep going up and up and up So hopefully this is a way that I can catch up and get to a point where um, I can compete with some of the big boys in the crew because the crew is so bloody strong. I am not even close to as strong as they are, but I am slowly catching up. I'm being consistent. I'm doing what I have to. And then before you know it, I should be in the top 15. I think I'm in the top 20 or top 25 right now. I'm not really that strong. Uh, some of these guys are hitting insane, insane, insane amount of damage. So uh, I, I can't even can't even cap they're doing at least double to triple the amount of damage that i'm doing so um so yeah that's it guys nothing too insane however a lot of great news as i say this is one of the best game on the mobile because you're literally getting an update that is absolutely game changer changing everything and yet guys the game keeps growing the game game keeps getting next level and for a lot of people that are just starting off please do not get disappointed all you can see is oh my god i can never reach the horizon very simple be consistent that's all you have to do trust me the recipe for this is simple consistency continue to play it don't just give up halfway and you're gonna come to the point where oh, i can't be ass you know like clicking on the game farming and this and that i'm getting bored of it just be consistent just do a few farms here and there 
make sure you're in stuff rather than not in stuff get things and just make sure you just keep going and keep playing and before you know it some of my subscribers have been telling me they're already at the position where they're at 160,000 they're trying to make it to the push of 180,000 they have all the equipments that they have they basically unlocked everything and here's a little trick guys you might be thinking you have to craft everything to get to the point where you can unlock everything no no no, no. that's not how it works how it works is that as you level up as you increase your damage what you can do is use intentional crafting methods to get the right kind of crafting equipment once you get the right kind of crafting equipment all you have to do next push those levels what i mean is as you push those levels you're going to get all these different drops when you get all these different drops of equipment you're going to be able to complete now all the different sets that you've never thought about and that's how i completed most of my sets where i was barely even paying attention to it and i was just farming what i had to and just keep going and going and going and before you know it you're unlocking all of these different things and so that is how you get to the next level when we hit about 150,000 to 160,000, it is a big, big jump from there to 180,000. Right now with Titan Souls, I'm not very sure how much more difficult it is. But back then, guys, tell me, if, I'm telling you, it was very difficult. You could be doing up to 50 to 100 prestigious and you are barely even pushing a thousand, um, a thousand levels because it, it just slows down dramatically. It really made me almost quit, almost made me break. Uh, however, Abyssal Tournament is the thing that saved me. It, it really just broke the mundane of the whole week. And then on Friday, you just get to be someone you're, you're normally not and just play that and just have fun and then just keep going. So I think Abyssal Tournament, I, I do have a high respect for it because it really just breaks the mundane and really helps with the gameplay and understanding how the game mechanics works as well. So it's, it's actually a very, very good thing to join. Not only do you gain items from it, not only do you gain points from it, not only do you gain the knowledge for it, you get an understanding of different types of builds and how those builds work. And if you like those builds, that you will stick to those builds and do it for yourself. All right, that's it for me, guys. Nothing too crazy. Uh, please don't have any wheels. Please don't have any wheels. I'm hoping nothing comes up soon. I got 18 minutes left before that tournament um, gate closes. I'm pretty sure it's one hour and then the gate closes and then you drop into the next bracket. So this is the best bracket that I'm in at the moment. So hopefully I am gonna stay being the whale. All right, that's it for me, guys. I hope you had a great week. We're coming into the middle of the week. Two more days, we're gonna have Bizzle Tournament. You will see another video drop tomorrow when um, I drop this end of tournament situation. And then we're gonna get to us uh, Friday. We're gonna get the Bizzle Tournament. Two more drops after that of videos. And then Saturday, another two more drops because of the tournament. So guys, there'll be videos all the way until next Monday night. And I will keep going with that. And so you're gonna look forward to all the different videos that will be popping up. So guys, drop a like, drop a subscribe as always. Thank you very much for joining me in this uh, particular season and where we are. And with this new version, V12272, Wah, wah, wee, wah, wah, wah. Thank you very much, guys. And let me finish off with this one little thing. Uh, what is he gonna do? Uh, critical damage per day times 1.25, whatever that even means. Ah, blah, 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 blah. Increase the damage dealt by blah, 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 blah. Oh, that's pretty solid. Damage dealt by pets, clan shape, basically everything gets 1.5 damage. Maximum effect of that and sets begins accumulate when you back and you unlock day since unlock once. Okay, sounds like a good idea. I bloody unlocked it on the first day. That should be able to get me to the next level, guys. So that's it for me, guys. Thank you very much for all of that. And I'll catch you at the next video. Bye-bye.